this is Hannah Fields and I'm Katie Moore and we serve Hunt County kids um, starting school. Tools for School is an organization that was started in 2004 with the women's ministry at Ridgecrest Baptist Church and they su supplied school supplies for 600 children. In 2006, it moved to a nonprofit organization and we began to um, collaborate with other area organizations in order to serve more children in our schools and provide backpacks um, to put those supplies in. Um, so far this year, we have served uh, 1,200 children and that is about the number of children that we serve every year. We partner with Greenville North Community Association um, in order to serve children um, 7th through 12th grade on their end and we serve kindergarten through 6th grade um, with tools for school. Today uh, we will be packing school supplies um, and then the children will be receiving the backpacks on Saturday. Um, there will be lots of different organizations that come out that day uh, to be represented to give resources to the families of these children in our community. Um, both medical resources and educational resources uh, and recreational resources for these families. Um, so we, if you would like to get involved in volunteering with Tools for School, you can look at our website at www.toolsforschool.org and uh, find out more information about our organization. Um, we are always the last week of July, if you would like to plan for that, um, every summer. So we look forward to seeing you come out and serve with us in our community and um, make Greenville a better place through serving our children in our schools. Luck. I'm with the Golden Kiwanis. It's an organization that's been involved in Tools for School now for the last, uh, well, I guess, eight years since they've been starting with it. Uh, our organization basically deals with doing a lot of things for kids in town. We have uh, clubs at the uh, high school that uh, they get trained on how to run meetings and everything else. And then we do a lot of things for the uh, town. We uh, build ramps for disabled folks. And uh, every time the town needs anybody, then uh, we come and help them out on different functions that they have. Uh, we are 40 guys and girls in the organization, and the organization's been here since 1987. My name is Bill Whitehead. I'm from Greenville, and uh, I'm working with CASA and Tools for School and several other organizations. And uh, basically, I just believe that this is one of the best things to happen to some of these children. They wouldn't be able to afford it, it's especially with large families. It's a terrible financial burden on these families. But uh, this is a major help, and everybody enjoys doing this. This is not labor, this is fun. My name is Barry Robinson, and I'm with the Gideons International. We've been working with Tools for Schools for a number of years to supply New Testaments for all the backpacks. And we're also the organization that puts Bibles in hotels and other places, hospitals. And it's always a great privilege to do this. Thank you, Bart.
are here, um, I'm with Community Seats, and we are at the uh, Tuolful Schools uh, event packing backpacks for school. We are the recipients of uh, the backpacks uh, that will go into Lone Oak ISD. And we have been doing this for about five or six years. Hello, my name's LaShonda Anderson, and this is Teresa Jones. And we're members of um, GNCA, which stands for Greenville North Community Association. Um, we started with Tools for School um, a few years ago, combining our organization with theirs because we were doing the same thing. Um, we provide school supplies for youth um, 7th through 12th grade, and we let Tools for School do the kindergarten through 6th grade. Um, I think it's a wonderful um, opportunity to be a part of all of this. Um, I think it impacts families that are in need that can't afford to provide the accurate um, school supplies for their kids for the school year. So I think it's just a, a great thing. Hi, my name is Josie Arsenio and I'm here with Ridgecrest Baptist Church and I've been working for Tools for School for like three years and yeah. Uh, I'm Clay Gibson. Um, I'm here with Tools for School. I got started a few years ago. Uh, I go to Ridgecrest Baptist Church and uh, our youth pastor uh, was rallying us up to do it and ever since I've just loved coming and doing it. My name is Andrew Claude. Uh, I've been coming to Tools for School since I was a little kid. My grandma would always drag me up here and uh, it's just kind of been like a habit ever since. Uh, I'm with uh, Ridgecrest Baptist Church and it's always fun to come out here. I like how we reflect the community, you know, everybody's going to come out and everyone's getting helped. Um, not one certain group of people are able to be helped, but we're really here for, for everybody who needs that education because education is going to be so important um, in this day and age, so yeah. I love how we have a unique ministry opportunity because uh, some of the people that come in, they may have never heard, you know, the gospel or anything, and we're able to put Bibles in their backpacks, and that's just an easy way. And I've personally seen some Tools for School people uh, come to Ridgecrest, so that's been really cool. Uh, for me, it's uh, on Saturday whenever we hand them out, just the look on the kids' faces whenever they get their supplies or backpacks and that they don't really have to pay for them. It kind of makes it all worth it for me. Hi, my name is Randy Rather. I am currently the president of the Greenville Lions Club and it is a privilege to be able to do this today. Greenville Lions have been a part of Tools for Schools from the very beginning. We provide, as you can see, people to help load the bags, but we also help provide the materials. We have been doing this I don't know, it was being done before I even moved to Greenville, and we're still doing it. It is a, my hope as current president to continue to be a part of the uh, growth and history of Greenville Lions in Greenville, Texas. Thank you. Hi, I'm Kami Williams with GEUS. I'm here with my fellow friends and JUICE employees, and we are volunteering today for Tools for School. And we are just so excited to be participating and part of our community and um, helping to support education today. My favorite thing about working with Tools for School is watching the faces of the students as they come through and actually put that backpack on their back. Uh, they make, it makes them feel like they are prepared for school and they are so happy to have those supplies and so my favorite thing uh, is just watching the faces of the students as they receive their backpack full of supplies. She took mine but I will also add that I enjoy seeing um, the other people in our community come together um, in order to serve these children from different organizations like Rotary Club and Kiwanis and um, lots of different organizations just coming together to promote um, one community. I would agree with both of these, um, but I would also say that I um, enjoy how the school district has come and allowed us to come in and be here and uh, serve our community here. Also for the Boys and Girls Club, for them to allow us to set up registration um, for a few days and to see the kids come through then is exciting. They're excited about school, um, they're excited about their school supplies, and um, also helping the families is just, it's a joy. There is power 
in community. There is power in knowing your neighbors and working with people who actually live here, not out-of-town strangers. There is power in being based here, in raising our children here. In fact, at Juice, we believe there's nothing more powerful than hometown service. Juice. Hometown service. World-class reliability.